Hey guys, it's me, Trudy, and I am back after some inactivity because I've been busy with a lot of things, but I never had the chance to finally introduce myself on this channel just to tell you guys about who I am and my interests and stuff. So that's what this video is going to be about, and I'm super excited because um, I don't think I've ever done this video on any of my other channels. Uh, some of you guys may know me from With the Dawn Hose, which is my mom's and basically my whole family's channel, or uh, Everything Disney Pins, which is also my family's channel, and Sea Cruisers, which is a cruising channel, and I've just been on a lot of those videos and uh, finally decided that I wanted to just create my own channel for you guys just about me. And I'm just going to start talking about everything about me. Alright, so I was born in North Carolina in a bathtub and uh, my mother is Elizabeth. I am currently 12. I'm super excited because my birthday is October 15th and it is October 3rd right now so I'm just so excited about that. I'm waiting for my birthday because I'm going to be turning 13 and it's so exciting for me. Finally gonna have a teen in my name. <laughs> I've been waiting a long time and I've been thinking about it all year. And Halloween is coming up, which is also really exciting for me. And anyways, this is my dog Sunshine. He is six years old. He just turned six in uh, July, on July 13th, when a baby turned six. I got him when he was about five months old, I do believe. And uh, I've had him ever since. He's super, super sweet. So he, I'm probably going to post videos about him on this channel just because there's a lot of things I have planned for you, Shin Shin. Mm. Anyways, I, as you might be able to see from my wall back here, uh, my main hobby and what I do is art. I love drawing. I always have, I mean, even since I was young, when I first got a DSi, uh, I did flip notes on it because that was really popular back when they first came out. I was always on flip notes, drawing and drawing, and then finally I took art more seriously and started doing it on paper. And ever since that time I started doing it more serious, I have uh, just been drawing all the time. <laughs> and I do art traits. I have an Instagram, which is blizzards underscore instart, and I post all my art on there. I do art traits, and behind me is my wall of commissions and trades I've gotten from people, which I love and I look at it every day. And um, I have some art over here with me. Let's see if I can find one for you guys to show you. This is like a small example of what I do. Here we go. This is a gift art I did for one of my friends on Instagram. And uh, I still need to send it to her. Uh, I was debating whether I'd keep it. I think I'm just gonna send it to her because I think she would probably enjoy it more than I would. Uh, I mainly draw wolves. Well, that's pretty much what I always drew, but recently I've gotten into drawing other things such as cats and just other types of animals. And uh, I've also, I also draw ponies, like My Little Pony, and I also have been practicing lately on drawing anime because I definitely am a big fan of anime. Love it. And uh, I also just love animals all together. Um, ever since I was small, I had, before I even drew, I had like stuffed toys of animals, little figures, little tiny little teeny ones that I got from Asheville. And, I, that's probably where my drawing started was just because of my love for animals and I always had a liking for small things like little small toys so I remember I had little small elephants and stuff when they were really cute but I have no idea where those went now <laughs> because um, we moved I lived in Asheville for about seven years and then we moved to Florida and I think we've been here for like we have been in Florida for about seven years and I'll ha I admit, there's a few different things I have a, a lot of more liking Florida. I like Florida more than uh, North Carolina. I used to live in Asheville, North Carolina. But um, the one thing I miss about Asheville is definitely I like the mountains, but the pollution in Asheville is really bad, so you, you couldn't really enjoy them that much. And I miss the chilly weather because in Florida, it is, <laughs> it's an oven here. Like you will go outside and you will just be melted on the ground. Like you, there's no, you don't even have a chance. The sun, it's like the weather might only be like 70 something, but with the sun and humidity, it feels like 100 and it's just terrible. Yeah. But that's another reason why I'm so excited for October, fall, and then winter because the weather is finally going to get chilly. And I do miss the snow in Asheville. I miss it. 
but I never really snowed, snowed that much anyway, so I never even made a snowman because there wasn't enough snow by the time we got out of bed to go get snow. It was all melted. There was like a few patches in the grass lying around. I'm just like, where's the snow? Why snow? Why? <sighs> Anyways, continuing on, uh, I love Florida because there's a lot more to do in Florida and Asheville and North Carolina all together. I mean, you, there's a few zoos and stuff, but there wasn't as much to do in Asheville as there is in Florida. And that's probably one of the reasons I love Florida so much is because there's Disney and there's just everything, Universal, Bush Gardens, and just little fun things around that aren't even like big amusement parks too, you know? And that's probably one of the reasons I love it here so much. Anyways, moving on to a few more of my interests. I do like My Little Pony. I used to be more into it than I am now, but I definitely enjoy drawing them more. Uh, I think one of the main reasons is after I stopped, I stopped drawing wolves for a little bit while uh, when we moved again, just to a different house, and uh, and I started drawing ponies more. So I drew ponies for like a year or two, and through that time, I definitely improved with art a lot and a lot. But then I decided that I really missed drawing wolves, so I started drawing them again. And honestly, you would think that wolves and ponies are like completely different. But like the leg shape and just every the shapes, okay. When you draw, I feel like the shapes are so similar even with everything you draw that once you learn how to draw something perfectly, you can use a technique from that thing to draw a different thing. So like, I I feel like I'm really good at drawing ponies. So now that I can draw those really good, it helps me a lot with drawing wolves. I don't know if you get what I mean, but uh, yeah. So definitely enjoy drawing ponies. I definitely do like My Little Pony. I have a lot of ponies as you can probably see in my room. And uh, I like uh, Disney characters, I like Stitch, and I like Lady and the Tramp, and I do collect Stitch pins, and I started collecting Lady and the Tramp pins because I recently got more into Lady and the Tramp. I don't have a lot yet, but I definitely do have a lot of Stitch pins. A lot, which I will probably show on this channel, and if not, then you can see a lot of them on my family's channel, which is Everything Disney Pins, and there'll be a little pop-up link up here and a link down in the description because that's probably where I post more of my pins. This, this channel is going to be more based around me and my art and just what I do, pretty much. Coming back to more recent things that I'm really excited about doing uh, are just happening. Like I said, Halloween and my birthday is coming up and I'm really excited about those. And I'm also excited for Christmas because uh, I have a hard time deciding. I love Christmas and I love Halloween. They're both like my favorite times of year and I have not decided yet which one is my favorite because they're both so different, but both like alike in a way. I might have to say Christmas, but then again, I really love Halloween, so just really hard decision for me. So I'm just really excited those are both coming up really soon. And uh, this is probably like, my favorite time of year, is like September and the months after that, just because so much is happening. Uh, in November, I'm on November 2nd, I do believe, I'm gonna be going on a cruise with uh, my mom's and my grandma, I think, uh, if she can make it. And I am going to go on another cruise on December, I do believe. And I'm excited. I'm so excited because I'm going to be vlogging everything I do on the cruises and posting on this channel. So definitely look out for those. And um, my mom is going to be vlogging on the cruise as well. And she's going to be posting them on her channel, which is Sea Cruisers. Those are some things that I'm very excited for and I cannot wait to go on. I'm thinking about it, I've had like cruise dreams, and just like, I love cruises, and in case you guys, I don't think I ever talked about this, I love cruises, like cruises are just amazing, like, I think that cruises are my favorite things in the entire world, I just like the feeling of being on the ship, and with the water, and like, the ship, and all the things to do, and the food, and the, everything is just awesome on the cruise ship, so I definitely love it, I love going, I love traveling, so being able to go to all these islands and stuff is just really fun for me, and I enjoy it a lot. Um, I forgot to mention that I do love LPS, which is Little's Pet Shops, and uh, I have a lot, and I recently haven't been taking as many pictures as I used to of them because I actually started taking pictures of like ponies and just drawing more. But I really want to get back into it because I enjoy taking pictures of them. And I have a Little's Pet Shop channel, which is LPS Fun TV, and uh, the link is right here, or down below in the description if you guys want to check it out. I post videos on there, and, uh, anyways, back to some of my interests, uh, currently with my art, I am trying to do commissions, which is basically what people pay me to do art for them, 
And uh, I'm only really interested in doing that because I love doing art and being able to do art as more of a job than just like a hobby or a free time thing or a pastime is just be really great for me because there's a lot of things I want <laughs> and I would love to be able to sell my art to people and make them happy with it like people do with me. As you can see, I buy art from people and um, if you guys are ever interested in purchasing art from me, you can definitely check out my prices on DeviantArt or Instagram which are both going to pop up here or link below in the description. Uh, I don't think I can put a link to Instagram because I don't think Instagram was on the web, but it is, as probably said before, Blizzard's Insta Art with an underscore. And um, I mostly do commissions on there because DeviantArt is... I'm still learning to use DeviantArt because after the update there's a lot of confusing things. And I'm pretty new to it. I've been on there for a few years, but I wasn't active until recently because I decided I'm like, I'm going to do DeviantArt. DeviantArt's pretty cool. Anyways, uh, that pretty much wraps up this video for this time. I will be back soon with more videos similar to this one and art videos and all kinds of different videos. So just keep watching, stay, stay with us. And if you like this video and want to see more like this, please subscribe, uh, like it, leave a comment. I love hearing feedback from you guys. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you next time.